Hello everyone, Simon here from MyFirstMagicWave.com making this uh, quick video for YouTube. Um, just showing you last week a couple of activities. The um, market is tight but I still uh, found some uh, nice setups that uh, give us our bread and butter for the week. Um, also wanted to show you the what I teach in my webinars and what uh, can you learn. So um, this is uh, one of the chart which is, uh, you can see it's a Newsy dollar index. I, um, by the way, if you watch my videos, uh, you will notice that I uh, pay very good attention to uh, these uh, individual currency indexes uh, that tells us uh, how, what and how the individual currency is doing, not the pair. I mean, uh, Kiwi is a Newsy dollar versus USD, right? Uh, or Euro USD means the pair that you're trading. But uh, you have two different indexes involved in it, uh, Euro index and Euro currency index and USD currency index, uh, separate. And somehow if you find out, uh, if you know a little bit about, uh, you know, harmonic patterns and every wave or support is uh, strand lines and all that, and if you can figure it out that, uh, yeah, Euro is in an uptrend and uh, it uh, probably is uh, hitting the trend line and uh, bouncing and then will go up, that means it's going to get strong. So index is showing that uh, it, it is getting a strong and your, your USD pair is somehow showing that uh, it, might go, it may go up a little bit more. Then it's sort of a confirmation from the index that yes, you know, if Euro gets strong, that's what the index is telling us. And then uh, your USD also telling us that it, it, is, uh, it need to go a little bit further because the risk is further uh, to the upside then it's, uh, you know, it's a confirmation, it's the added, um, you know, confirmation. And that usually uh, very, very, uh, you know, useful to me. So that's how it is. Um, now look at this, um, for example, I'm going to show you that this is a New Dollar Daily Index. And it is a harmonic pattern called bad pattern, which is the first pullback is 50%. Uh, Let me show you if I have it here. So, yeah, um, uh, no. Okay, this one. See, I have made all of uh, these uh, diagrams uh, my own, harmonic trading. This is uh, one of those, uh, okay, I messed up here. This one I wanted to show you. This is a bearish bat, and this has all the calculation and everything, and, you know, it's like X, A, B, C, D. It has five points, and after that, you have a reaction. You can also trade uh, this pattern uh, going up uh, from C point. As I say here, you know, trade number one, buy at C, trade number two, sell uh, uh, by the break of point B because you have a, quite a bit of distance here, which you can take advantage uh, of it. If it's a four-hour pattern, then you're talking about, you know, 150, 200 daily, even more. So why waste, right? And so buy um, at the break of point B, and then if it goes there, and then it drops. Usually, you know, it comes and hits this trend line. If you draw a trend line connecting A to C, or even goes further down and that would be the trade number three so one of these pair if you identify and I teach that then how you identify and how you trade and uh, give you also uh, the magic wave strategy to pinpoint entries with maximum uh, stop loss of 20 pips you know, 15 to 20 pips which is nothing you can always recover that so it's a very precise uh, uh, entry uh, uh, strategy Anyway, so this is a uh, bearish bad pattern, and um, this is the one I um, uh, located here. You can see here X, A, B is there 50%, C is here, D goes and posted a divergence, and exactly right, you know, at that number, and this is if you pull out a weekly chart, you will see it's a huge resistance. So, you know, one of those areas and or, or point weekly resistance is very, very important. That's what I said is, you know, it's a weekly resistance. I need to be respected. Even though the 78.6 number is a little bit further, but it was a very good chance that it were dropping. And also, uh, the thing is that after seeing this, I wanted to see uh, what New Z USD is doing, Kiwi, Kiwi dollar is doing, I mean, Kiwi uh, pair. You know. And uh, coincidentally, uh, I found similar pattern there. Uh, no, this is uh, after that index what it did right this is the index see that i had that and then um this is what happened uh this uh point was you know very much respected right <laughs> and we are still dropping the first target is already met the second one is going to be you know 
may be wavering, but uh, I'll see um, how it goes. But, you know, it, it did exactly what I was uh, expecting. And uh, what effect it had on the US, uh, New Zealand uh, USD pair is this. See, it was here. When the index was there and I said it's going to make a turn, and it was almost a similar pattern, bad pattern. It's about to compete. It was a little bit shy. And I thought if the index is going to go up to 78.6%, then this will go up to 88.6% and then drop. But uh, it, the index dropped right from there. Uh, and uh, this one also. Let's see what happened here. This is what happened. Okay. So it just came down crashing, and we have a target here. So it is still coming down support uh, maybe it's gonna bounce from here a little bit and then maybe drop even further so we will see how it goes it depend on USDX US dollar index as well okay so right now the Kiwi is getting weaker and that's what's happening also uh, see like I said this one this is also more than 200 pips so one of these charts of mine if you get and if you follow you will get your bread and butter for the week out of just one setup uh, in, in the usually I send out uh, you know several setups to my uh, subscribers remember these um, these this uh, uh, forex market is it's all about uh, harmonic uh, and Elliott wave so uh, if you pinpoint you can always find a setup there is always a setup it just it, you know it's a matter of what do you know okay if you if you if you can see harmonically anything then you will see something you know the Elliott wave oh okay the fourth wave is just finished we need to go up for the fifth wave. All right, so what the index is saying, okay, it is also going up, so let's go up. This is how it is. So you see this, the pattern was finished here with the divergence, so the index was give, telling us that it's going to go down. So it's the New Z uh, dollar, New Z USD. Okay, another one was, uh, let me show you if I have it. Yes, see this one is Aussie dollar. US, US, uh, New Zealand dollar and Aussie dollar, they are both uh, Asian currencies, go hand, uh, hand to hand, you know, side by side uh, also uh, yen but uh, I didn't see any setup on yen I mean we are following the yen uh, triangle for uh, months and months now and it is uh, you know going exactly the way we are uh, seeing it uh, that's another issue I'm not showing that in this video but this is uh, Aussie dollar you can see here it was it's easy if you just draw a few lines and and, and Fibonacci tool you see if I put price is targeting 165.90 to 1.66 Break or reject time will tell because I had this feeling strongly that it will break, but I would never say that, okay, this is what might uh, happen. One time, one thing at a time. So it was going up. Once you reach the, 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 the bus station, what I call, <laughs> then I'll say, okay, now this is possibly that it will go. So for at, at this point, we were going up. So I said, okay, we will be targeting 66. And you know what? This is what we did. We target, we reach 66, so three, only three pips different. And then drop back to, you know, here. At this, right now we are sitting at the trend line. I know where it is going, and that, that would be another video for my subscribers. Maybe which I'll send out over the weekend. Uh, today, Saturday, probably uh, tomorrow. So this is uh, what it is. Uh, if you join, you will get all these charts and uh, understanding ahead of time to uh, take advantage and uh, like I said again one of these charts will give you uh, the whole week of bread and butter easily uh, more than 200 pip in uh, New Zealand uh, New Zealand I mean Kiwi right and uh, there are some other uh, uh, you know charts and, and pairs as well which uh, uh, gave us some pips but I'm gonna wrap this uh, video up here and uh, see if you uh, like it and if you want to join and just go on my website uh, myforexmagicwave.com the address is right here and join us uh, and uh, you will be getting all these uh, charts uh, I started a new thing that I'm you know just make a small video just like this one and I send out you know the setup the chart and explanation what it is and how it is this is what I did I mean Aussie uh, uh, index and use the index I made a video I send it out and tell us everybody on my subscriber to, you know to watch out for the short side uh, and uh, look for the short setups in those uh, two pairs and that's what we did so this is what it is thanks for watching have a great day